And hello, hello, hello. Oh no, my internet light is on. Oh, there you go. Now it's off. Let me know if I'm blurry. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Yes, KK, absolutely. If you can, that would be greatly appreciated. As always, appreciate it, appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Um, wasn't even sure it was going to come today. <laughs> Wasn't even 100% sure I was going to, but I'm here. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Let's see who else is here. I know KK's here. Hi, KK. Hi, honey. Miss Heather Kep Kelpine is in the chat. Hi, Heather. Heather, I have to say your last name because we have a couple of different Heathers. Ding, 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 ding. Mr. Birthday Boy is in the chat. Everybody, please wish my good friend Christopher Chatworth AKA I buy Chit a very, very happy birthday. Woo -hoo -hoo. Happy birthday, Christopher. Hi, Gloria, honey. How are you? Vintage Memories is here. Hi, Robin. Mr. John Beck on deck. Should we sing happy birthday to Christopher? Do we have enough of us here to sing happy birthday? Christopher, Christopher. Still says there's one person here, but I know better than that. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Christopher. Happy birthday to you. Yay, Christopher. Yay! Happy birthday, Christopher. We, you know we love you. Well, at least I do. I don't know about anybody else in the chat. but <laughs> KK made the sign, Christopher. KK made it. She's very talented. That's why she always buys crafts. <laughs> Oh, but anyway, thank you. Thank you guys for wishing Christopher a very happy birthday. He's always so gener generous to all of us. Um, and some of us are still sitting on some, um, oh, in fact, that's what I did last night. I came across the, um, the T-Bucks list and make, make sure you guys are using, if you have your uh, credit from our giveaway make sure you're using that if i forget reminds me i'm crossing people off as they get it um but that was all compliments of christopher so yeah i know rumma just got some with me and tony patano and michelle caldwell I haven't seen michelle in a while well where's karen kj Ranch. I haven't seen Karen either. Yes, KK, you did. You did. You did. You did. All right. What's going on with my? It's so weird. My um, my stream yard is so weird. Ah, uh, thank you, D. You it. Same here. And uh, hi, Deb. How are you? Deb, I hope you're well. I, I was so happy to see you yesterday for the first time. I hope everything is good. I turn a white leather purse to a red and put fabric on it. You do. You do, you do. All right. Um, so let me tell you what I have today. Um, again, more stuff from the storage unit. I have some vintage stuff like um, I don't know, some miniature figurines uh, like Annie and Looney Tunes and a bunch of stuff. I have some uh, die-cast cars and some, I don't know, I think they're Star Wars. Uh, we'll take a look at them. Some multi-quantity in that for my resellers. Um, I bought a, a big bundle of costume jewelry we can take a look at. Um, still have plenty of hair equipment. And I have some more of those sunglasses. If anybody didn't pick up that deal yesterday and still wants to pick that deal, pick that deal up, I'll show some today. Um, what else do I have? Oh, I have a box of, um, I think, WWF um, 
not the figures, but uh, the background and some other stuff. We'll take a look at that. Hi, Jill. How are you, sweetheart? Nice to see you. Haven't seen you in a while. I hope you're well. Heidi. Hello, hello, hello. And Chance is in the chat. Hi, found by Chance. How are you? Thanks for coming in, guys. Appreciate it. It shows that nobody is here. <laughs> it's so funny. There's something going on either with YouTube or something. Gaylene is here. Hi, Gaylene. Gaylene, something. Look at Oh, I found more shoelaces, Gaylene. I meant to grab the box. All right. Anyway, um, that's some of the stuff that I have. Uh, I mentioned yesterday I did have some fabric. I forgot to grab a pile, but I will. Um, oh, and some more. I don't know. Those belts yesterday were very interesting. And some purses, and uh, I don't know. We'll just throw some stuff up there from the um, storage unit that was that's in boxes and bins, and we'll just figure out what it is. Maybe I'll um, create a table while we're on because I can. <laughs> because I can, I can, can. Denise, hi, Denise, honey. Welcome in, welcome in. Thank you for joining. All right. All right. Let me. Oh, and that's the other thing. I um, I found some more religious piece pieces in the jewelry too. I'll do kind of separately, um, and maybe a couple of one-off pieces. Oh, thank you, Patricia. Patricia's like, oh my gosh, T. I got my package of packages i'm beyond thrilled everything is wonderful i'm so happy yay patricia i don't even know what you call patricia but i'm glad you're happy i'm glad i'm glad i'm glad and i'm hopefully going to be heading back quickly very quickly this weekend or close to the weekend the end of the week to grab the rest of the uh boxes out of this storage unit that i bought uh, i'll be a quick turnaround it'd be like one night and i'm going to come back um because I can't afford to be away. And I miss you people when I'm away. <laughs> Facebook user, welcome, welcome. Come on over to YouTube so we can see your smiling face. Is that Lucinda? Oh, who is that? I'm never sure. But come on over to uh, YouTube so we can see you. All right, let me throw my other camera on. Maybe we'll start off with these Annie pieces that I have. I don't know. There's a few of them. We'll throw them up there. We'll do a countdown. KK. KK is going to call Silt for us. I didn't see. Um... Hold on a second. Sorry. All right, sorry about that. Um, I didn't see Carrie in the chat, so let's see who else is here. Yeah, I see that music. All right, uh, no Carrie, no Heather, no Peggy. Vintage memories. Do you want to verify for a little while until somebody shows up? I know sometimes you don't mind helping. I know KK will call the souls. There it, there's, there's her souls. Pam, here's my face. I packed Pam's box today. I forgot to give it to you, didn't I? All right. Be glad to. I'm home for the evening. Well, thank you, Robin. I appreciate that. Awesome. All right. So Robin will verify the winner. So when we do the 15 second countdown, for those of you who might not be familiar, I'll put something up on the table. As soon as I show it all, or if it's just one thing and I explain it, the first bid we see in the chat will start to count it down. Um, and then, um, oh, I was the Facebook user. All right, Pam, what are you doing? <laughs> um thank you pam for your help pam's been such a help let me tell you with the new channel she's been awesome um we'll, we'll count it down and kk will type sold once i say sold 
and vintage memories will verify who was the person who was the highest bidder above the soul. You guys sometimes will see something different on your end, especially if it's you. So we always have to use a neutral third party. And uh, that will be vintage memories. Thank you. Oh my God, I hope you didn't call in today. I'm in trouble with you, but that's the problem. All right. Rob's here too. Everybody say hi to Rob. Rob's texting the postman. Rob's texting the postman because he's really late. Monday he's usually late. And he might be really late too because um, no one showed up on Saturday. So he's probably really behind. But the truck usually comes about 530. And at least with my eBay stuff, I have to make that truck. I think he's making pork chops tonight. Is he making pork chops tonight? Mm -hmm. He is. Yes, please no comps in the chat, guys. Um, once we sell it, I don't care. You guys can tell us how much it's worth, how much it's not worth, how much somebody paid, underpaid, overpaid, whatever you want to do. It's all good. Um, dirt and dust is always free here at the auction. Yes, I said it. And deal with it. <laughs> Who usually calls me out on that? Is it D? Somebody calls me out on it. Don't know. JJ! Hi, JJ. <laughs> How are you, sweetheart? Nice to see you. Yes, free shipping, $40 and above. Yes, did everybody get their motivational email from me today? From Team T Academy. Came my first one released this morning. Make sure you're still signed up. He's still working. All right. Okay. All right. He's on his way. He's just busy, busy, busy. Soft close. KK, thank you, honey. Bid, bidding increments, um, $2 from 1 to 50 $5, 50 to 100 and over 100 we do $10. Um, yay. Gaylene says, yes, she got hers. Awesome. Everyone saying hi, Rob. Hi, everyone. He's going to get them. We've got about 30-something packages going out today, so he's going to go and make, greet the mailman and make sure that we get it all loaded up. Hopefully, they make the truck. They might hold it up if they're that far behind, um, especially for my eBay. I just don't like to get dings for that stuff. KK says, I got mine. Awesome. All right, so, guys, don't forget to sign up for that. No, KK, no, we didn't. Um, unless, did you send it to the house or did you send it to the store? You sent it to the house. It's because we haven't been home since early this morning. You sent it to the store. My mailman hasn't been here yet. So, um, and if it's coming UPS, hmm, that could be an issue because uh, he may knock at the door while I'm on with you guys and Robbie leaves because they're usually late. So I'll have to excuse myself, but it's all good. All right. Reminder, 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 guys, be on live chat or all comments uh, so that you're uh, bidding in correctly. I am going to do the first one as a countdown. I'm going to switch my camera over and we'll do a couple of smaller uh, reseller lots, but just a little bit smaller, maybe collectors, who knows. And... Uh, Let me, um, I sent it to the same place. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but that's all right. It's all good. All right. I'm switching my camera over. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So these are called Knickerbocker, the world of Annie. They are dated 1982 on these. And let me show you what I have. They're carded. And they're miniatures. And hopefully my lighting's a little bit better today. I keep trying to add lighting. That's supposed to be Daddy Warbucks. 
let me move my camera up a little down a little bit so you guys can see that a little better this is Punjab 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 here is Miss Hannigan And guys, we'll do this as a 15 second countdown. So be ready, be ready, be ready. All right, now as far as, let's see. There's supposed to be three different Annie figures. I don't know if they're all here. So this looks like one of them in her sailor suit there. This is one of hers here. Um, who is this supposed to be? I don't know all the characters. I'm sorry. And there's actually two of these. And then there's supposed to be Molly, Pepper, Sandy, Lily, Grace. So... And rooster. No, that's Sandy. Sandy was the dog. Sorry. Sandy was the dog. Oh, is this supposed to be Daddy Warbucks? Yeah, I think so. And this is Miss Hannigan again, I believe. All right, so that's what you're going to get. You got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve of them. 12 pieces. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Linda. How are you guys? All right. So, Annie, 1982 carded figures by Knickerbocker. And we'll do it as a countdown. As soon as I see a bid in the chat, we'll count it down. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to be sold. Mary is holding nothing back. Mary came in first, and it looks like. Ooh, Gaylene. I thought Mary had the $40 power bid. 44 to Gaylene. Thank you, guys. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. All right. Next little lot up is Looney Tunes. And they are Christmas ornaments. And they are 1978. Let me see what the back says. Hold on a second, and I'll let you guys know. Um, oh, it just says, oh, it does have a year, maybe. Let me see. Warner Brothers. Nope, it does not. Oh, yes, 1977. Petunia Pig. I think we'll have to do it. Sleepy. Now it looks like Sleepy's eyes because of the age of these. They're made in Hong Kong. Uh, Sleepy's eyes are a little off there. Um, so buyer beware. Here is Bambi. Yeah, made in Hong Kong for Liberty Bell Christmas. Oh, Hicksville, New York. My husband graduated from Hicksville High School. So did Billy Joel, just FYI. So this one is 1979. All right, here's a Porky Pig. Now, Porky Pig also, his eye is in there, but it's not on his face. So I don't know if it pays to open these up and re-glue them or what. But 
just letting you guys know because of age. Now this one, this one looks like uh, he's one of the mice. Let's see. What's his name? I have to look. I have to look at the back. This guy is called Merlin Magic Mouse, 1977. Here is Honey Bunny. Honey Bunny. And this is another one of the uh, panda. So some of them say Walter Lance Presents, and this one has the uh, Woody Woodpecker on it. And these say The Wonderful World of Disney. What was that Bambi? That was, well, it just says Hong Kong. I thought there was another year on there. And then some of them say Looney Tunes. Now, this one is Pluto. I'm going to toss this one in, but Pluto has a broken arm. Just FYI, you could see Pluto's arm in there. KJ! Hi, honey. Again, um, now this one was made in Portucket, Rhode Island. Well, no, actually it says it's made in Hong Kong. But the company was in Portucket, Rhode Island. So you've got a couple of different uh, brands and a couple of different ones there. And you've got two, four, six, eight, ten of them total. Hi, Cat Feeling Thrifty. Hi, guys. Welcome in. Linda, did I say hi to you, honey? I'm not even sure. Um, but thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. And i got to pop my other chat out. But for some reason, it didn't pop out. So let's pop it out. It didn't pop. It didn't pop out. All right, and we'll count it down as soon as we see a bid. Are they toys or ornaments? They look like ornaments, um, flipping hot finds. See, they have the little uh, ties at the top. All right, we'll go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. Looks like Denise is going to pick them up for 20. Thank you, Denise. That's Denise L. All right, guys. The next one I'm going to do as a, um, a regular auction. Going once, going twice, and sold. Um, because we do have quite a bit in this lot. Um, and they're multiple, multiple pieces. And I'll show you what it is. I'll put all the boxes up here first. All right. And it's one, two, and three different types. So these are all the same. These are all the same. And these are all the same. One, two, and three. And I believe they're all Star Wars. And the first one, there's four of these. And these are called, they're unassembled in here. And they're still sealed in their bag. These are Kenner. And this one is called... Bomar Monk, 1997, and I'll leave them. I'll leave the one thing so you guys can read it if you want. 
Um, so there's four of those. This one does not have an insert on it. Um, these do have skews. This one has a skew of 69736. It's um, one of these glow wizards, and they're all the same, and you're going to get two for six of these, six of exactly the same of those. <clears throat> They're all Star Wars, yeah. And then this one, I don't think is, this one doesn't have a thing in it either. Let me see. Maybe, I thought this one did have one. Maybe just that particular box doesn't have it. No, maybe they don't. All right. So this, or maybe it's written on it. No, nope, just says warning. All right. So this one is an, a skew of 69734. And there are two, four, six, twelve of these. And I don't know if you want to take a Google lens of this. Here's what he's got a um, a gun pack. These are all sealed too, guys. Um, but they're all the same. I did check that. I just didn't realize that they didn't all have papers in them to explain what they are. But I'm sure Google Lens is your friend. Carrie! That's okay, honey. Thank you for joining. All right. And those are 12 of those. So you got 12 of those, six of these, and four of these. For a total of 22 pieces. And Gaylene comes in for 30. Thank you, Gaylene. Or is that Gaylene from the other? Or is that Gaylene from the other? Um... <laughs> Hi, Terry. How are you, honey? Thanks for coming in. No, oh, my camera's blurry again. Sorry, guys. Let's see if we can't fix it. <coughs> Green is spirit of OB1. All right. All right. Bear with me one second. Let me switch my camera back and forth. Sometimes that helps with the um, helps with the. There we go. I don't know. This this camera is really it's crazy sometimes. Mm -hmm. Only one Kenobi. Yep. So you got 12, 6, and 4. And Gaylene's in at 55. Hi, Jay, honey. How are you? Nice to see you, Terry. Thanks for coming in, honey. All right, so three different Star Wars here. The Bomber Monk, four of them. The, what did uh, Robin call them? OB, Spirit of Obi-Wan, six of those. And then the 12 on the funny looking guy. <laughs> Gaylene's in at 55. 60 would be the next bid. Let us know. Guys, if you no longer wish to be in, just type out um, and we will count it down. Just let us know, Terry. Um, who else was bidding? Heather. Heather's in at 60. Thank you, Heather. Gaylene comes in for 65. Nice little easy list for you guys. Three things that have to be pictured. 
for 22 items listed. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. Thank you everyone for coming in. I appreciate it. No idea how many people are here because something's going on with the counter and it tells me one person's in the chat. Now it says zero, so that one person left. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Sometimes YouTube, StreamYard, I don't know who's acting up. Who knows? Thank you, KK. KK can see it. I can't for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> Moon Flipper. Hi, Courtney, honey. All right. Heather, let us know. Terry, let us know. Gaylene's in for 65. If you haven't wished our friend Christopher Chatworth I buy Chip a happy birthday, make sure you do that today. All right, Heather's going to be out. Terry, let us know. He was in the beginning, Moon Flipper. I don't know if he's still here, but yes, he, it is his birthday. <laughs> Terry comes in for 70. Yeah, right. 75 to Gaylene. Robbie's over here singing this song Moon Flipper. I didn't know he knew a song named Moon Flipper. Guys, make sure while we're um, bidding on this, if you guys are not bidding, make sure you're checking your live chat. Make sure it's on live chat, not oh, top God, chat. Make sure that you have... Um, I, I think it's his time to be on the poll, right? <laughs> yes. Well, it's his birthday, so I just want to make sure everybody wishes him a very happy birthday. If you see him out and about. All right, Terry's going to be out. We're going to count it down. He's not taggable. All right, so I guess he left. All right. Hi, Ozma, honey. Welcome in. We're going to go once. We're going to go twice. KJ, ding, 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 ding. KJ pulls the trigger late. Yes, City Hen, you do. Can't you see it there? <laughs> You're good, sweetheart. 
Baleen is out. KJ with the scoop and the snipe at the last minute. Twenty-two pieces of Star Wars, three different types. You want to hear the bell? Oh God, you want Robbie to be? Robbie's out with the post office, though. <laughs> now that I made everybody deaf. <laughs> All right, Gaylene's out. We're gonna call it down to KJ. Going once. Going twice. And we're going to give it a fair warning. And we're going to sell them to KJ for $100. Thank you, KJ. Well, I got to think they're worth at least 10 or $15 a piece. So even at $10 a piece, that's what, 220 Definitely doubling your money, right? You're welcome. Thank you. Margo. Hi, honey. All right. Next thing up here, guys, is um, I'm going to take, let's take a look at these pendants. These are, I don't know if you guys were here, if any of you were here yesterday, we had some, um, we had some very interesting, uh, what were they called? They were called, um, Oh my gosh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Gosh, help me. Uh, comedy and drama, right, on the pendants. Oh no, those were pins. So these here that I have, and I'll bring them a little closer to the light so you can see them a little better. Um, these are like a skeleton with crossbones pendant. Here's a spider, a spider one, and there's a couple of different ones. This is a different skeleton with crossbones. This is a bat. Thank you, Periwinkle. Yes, hit hit the like button for T. And then we have what looks to be handcuffs. Now they're independent, but I'd probably put two of them together um, on those. And so let's see what other different ones we have. Here's a similar, is that similar? That's exactly the same. I'll put this down here. Uh, these are sold to KJ for 100. You missed the bell. KJ wanted the bell rung. What did Jared say? Somebody was here Saturday? He said a guy Tony said he was here by about three o'clock. Nobody was here. He's full of that. Not watch, but I said. <laughs> I was all live at three o'clock on Saturday. Yeah, we were here about quarter to six. Yeah. This is KJ. Yeah. All right, guys, sorry. I just want to see if I can clear this up. All right, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Um, yes, thank you. Um, thank you, Chevelle. Thank you, honey. So that's what we have so far. And I think this is a same spider, maybe a little bit different. I almost feel like the spider might be a little bit different. One looks pewter. The other one looks just silver tone this one for this skull looks a little pewter 
a pewterish. 710 oil. Hi, honey. Thank you for coming in. Whoopsie. Oopsie, oopsie, oopsie. All right. So I was looking to see if there's anything different. And I don't see anything different. This is definitely going to be a reseller lot because you're going to get a bunch of these the same. One or two of these skeletons are missing the ring to hang them as a pendant, just FYI. I'll count and let you know how many of each we have of everything. No, this what this skeleton looks a little bit different. So there's a couple of different variations thereof. Yep, they definitely could be made into anything. Got the handcuffs, bunch of handcuffs there. There's more. But wait, there's more. Oh, this is even a different skeleton and crossbones. So you definitely have a little mix here of stuff. It's almost Halloween listing time. Ah, ah, ah. The way they rush back to school these days, I wouldn't be surprised. The kids aren't even out of school and they're already doing back to school. I am not counting them, guys. I'm just putting them on there to give you an idea about how many of everything there are. Um, it seems like there's a lot of skull and crossbones. Not too many spiders, not too many bats. You got two, four, five bats two four spiders and then a bunch of handcuffs and tons of skull and cross bur bur bones different variations oh here's another spider actually guys if you sold these for a dollar a piece you'd be making a profit could lock them up too for that matter here's how many more i did not show okay that's how many more i did not show and here's a little o-ring a couple of them do need like i said a couple of the skeletons definitely need um All right, we're going to count them down. We're going to count them down. We're going to go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. And it looks like Jay's going to get them for 25 Thank you, Jay. It's a great deal, honey. Instead of handcuffs, you're going to get 5 bucks for. <laughs> I know it. 
Trust me. Usually when you get handcuffs, it's a lot more than five dollars. <laughs> uh, Just saying. All right. All right, all right. Don't be telling secrets out of the house. Telling any secrets? All right. Ford 1965 Red Mustang by Mira, made in Spain. Hood, hood comes up, doors open, trunk opens, got a little dirt and dust, does need to be cleaned. We also got a Mira 1965 Ford Mustang hardtop convertible, also in red. Also, the hood comes up. Also, the doors open. I think the top comes off, but I'm not going to attempt it, guys. Heather's like, my dream car. And if you want the 1965 Ford Mustang hardtop convertible in black, well, guess what? You can have that one, too. They are cool. They just need a little polish and wax. <laughs> does the steering wheel turn? I don't know, does it? Oh yeah, how did you know oil? It does. How did you know oil? You must have these. <laughs> All right, let's start him off at 25. Oh, you used to collect them. Oh, that answers it. Guys, I'm gonna put a gift in here. I'm gonna put a gift in here. This one is a Revel 1965 Mustang. These are all 118th scale. This one's in an orange with a hard top, but it's a gift. No, Ed, I do not. It's going to be a gift because it is missing one wheel. Um, but maybe you guys can find the wheel and it does have a little bit of scuffing. Oh, no, it doesn't. That's just the uh, logo. I'm sorry. And that one's an orange color, but with a missing wheel. But I'll throw it in as a gift um, in case you guys want to seek out the um, the wheel somewhere online. And this one is by Revel, not by uh, Mira. Mira is the other three. M-I-R-A, 118th scale, 19. 65 Ford Mustangs. Just need some hydraulics, right? That's true. I mean, if you're displaying them, maybe you can get like one of those uh, artificial jacks and just jack the car up like he's changing the tire. Because I know the spare is in the trunk. Now, see, the, let me see. The other trunks open. Does this trunk open? See, this one isn't, this one, the hood opens, but the trunk on this one doesn't open like it does on the mirror. The doors open, the hood opens, but not the trunk on the Revel. See, the trunks on these open, and they've got the spare tire inside. Steal one. <laughs> Rob's like, steal the tire. All right, we've got vintage memories in for 30. Any other interest, guys? Let us know. Heather J. Thank you, Periwinkle. Periwinkle.
Hey, she picker. All right, Heather's going to be out. Hey, hey, hey. We're celebrating 507 listings. Woo, woo, woo. Yay, she picker. All right, we're going to go once. Jay, let us know, honey. I didn't see a, a bid or an out from you. We're going to go twice now. And we're going to give it a fair warning. Jay, I would love to see a decision from you before I call it, hon. No bitter left behind. All right, I think we lost Jay. All right, we're going to sell to Vintage Memories. Great deal, Robin. $30 to Vintage Memories. Congratulations, honey. Jay got disconnected. Oh, what happened? Guys, don't forget when you're bidding, though, if you can... If you don't want to bid anymore, just type out. It does help us. Then I don't feel guilty that I left somebody out or behind. It was, right, 710? It's an awesome deal. All right. Let's try that again. This is a Durango made in Italy, 118th scale Ferrari. Made in 1987, or is it a 1987 F40? I don't know a lot about Ferrari, so I'm not sure. Does anybody know? Durango Ferrari, made in Italy, 1987 F40. And this one is a Ferrari 512 Testarossa. Made in Spain. This one is by Mira. He must be taking a nap with Christopher <laughs> Carey. <Yeah>. Hi, Shaney. <laughs> yeah, you know what? To be honest with you, I don't know. He could be at work. Maybe he got called away or something. You never know. Thank you, KK. Yes, we'll start these two at 20. It's the only two Ferraris I have. <laughs> John comes in at 20. Thank you, John.
All right, no other interest. We're going to count it down to John. We're going to go once. We're going to go twice. And we're going to give it a fair warning. Put a Barbie in them next time. <laughs> Very wink <old. laughs> All right. And we're going to be sold to John Beck for $20. Nice deal, John. Well, I wish you could really buy a, a Ferrari for $20, huh? <laughs> Thank you, honey. All right. John, I think I have something hanging for you, too, don't I? All right. These are boxed. Uh, there are one, two, three, four, five, six different ones here. The first one up is a model power HO scale firefighter heavy duty die cast here's what it looks like new in box you're welcome honey made in hong kong on that this one is a little larger firefighters model power heavy duty die cast number eight nine six eight made in macau it looks like that one says a little larger on that one this one says it's a winross new dimensions in communication it says it's a 1981 garnu not sure what that is so we're going to look at it together we're all going to get an education no oh, it's a truck it's a tractor trailer It's not an 18 wheeler, but it's a tractor trailer. Hi, Mama G. How are you, hon? All right, Garnu on that one. Next one up is a Beckins. It's another Winross. These are all boxed, guys. Just FYI. You're going to get all the boxes with these. This one is a brilliant. It's by Concor. Made in the good old USA. So some of them definitely look like they're for HO. This is a 187 scale on that one. And the last one is another Winross, 1988. Sunoco Ultra Racing Team. Hagen Racing Team, it says. Sterling Martin. Marlin is the driver on that one. All right, so you get the two fire trucks, the tractor trailer for Garnu, for Beckins, and for Sunoco with the uh, Sterling Marlin driver. And again, everything comes in its original box. Hi, No Place Like Home. How are you? John comes in for 35. Good, honey.
honey. Forty to no place like home. Thank you guys. Guys, don't forget to hit the thumbs up, please. John is out. Carrie is out. Do I? Yes. No. Ah. Uh, do you? I have to look, sweetheart. I don't remember. Maybe some crafting beads? Does that sound like you? I know KK does. I think you do too. I have to look. You guys have to go out tomorrow, I think. I'll take a look. Thank you, Periwinkle. Yes, that's right. Yes, she remembers. <laughs> All right, we're going to call it to No Place Like Home Crochet going once. We're going to go twice now. And let's give it a fair warning. Oh, KJ. KJ comes in at 42. KJ, KJ must have gotten a good night's sleep and took a shower early. <laughs> yes, John. Yes, honey. Absolutely. Just easier for me, hon. It's just much easier. Keep track. You guys get a nice receipt. It's just more organized for me, and T likes to stay organized. No place like home comes in for 45. And I do invoice you once you hit 40. If anybody did not hit 40 and would like an invoice with shipping, just let me know. And um, if, you, um, if you're here every day and you're buying as well, guys, I don't mind holding things a day or two and invoicing you after a couple of days if you want to, you know, purchase a couple of days in a row. I'm good with that, too. Um, I just I just ask that once I do invoice you that you guys pay in a timely manner. I am going to start cleaning off my shelf in another uh, couple of days. And if you're on my shelf, I'm going to just get you um, invoice. T is awesome. And she didn't turn her back on us, Heidi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He does it right. Thank you, KJ. KJ, let us know if you're in or out, honey. We need 47, sweetheart. Or an out. Oh, gosh. No problem. It's just like check PayPal often. Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, guys, don't forget to check your PayPal and, and don't forget KJ's in for 47. Um, if I if I send you an invoice too and you're like, T, I think I have something else on the shelf. Sometimes I do miss something as well. So just reminds me um, if I send you something and I forgot something on the shelf. It does happen, especially if it's been a little bit wild. Auctions for you. Son, sorry. Oh, that's all right, sweetie. No problem. I know you're good for it, Lori. It's all right. We had a ton of shipping to do today, so we'll get you out tomorrow. Anybody who paid late today or if you didn't see a notification of shipping, I'll get you out tomorrow. Um, all right. No Place Like Home Crochet is out. We're going to count it down to KJ going once. We're going to go twice now, and we're going to give it a fair warning. Oh, 
And we're going to sell it to KJ for $47. Congratulations, KJ. It was right, Pam. What so? Ah, uh, so. I'll be gone at the girls' trip until Sunday. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, no problem. No problem, she picker. I'll wait. I'll wait till Monday if you want. No worries. All right, let's do. I have um. I have this box of wrestling. It's kind of just a miscellaneous box of wrestling. Uh. Equipment, I guess you would say, like from the WF, like that, and this ladder. And I'm assuming some of this goes with one another. There's this ring. I'll let you know if we have the rest of it in here because there's a lot of pieces, like. I think this all goes to the stage back here. Yeah, and this ramp probably. And this says something about resting in peace. And something happened to somebody. And then there's these um, gates. I don't know. Do they all go with that all that gray stuff there? Possibly puts together some cage or something. A chair and another little ladder. Some of it does have to be cleaned for sure. Tables that break in half. And I don't know, somebody saved these wrestling cards. Looks like maybe there was some guys on the other side, but these are the characters and their bio profiles. I don't know, U.S. mailbox. This is an interesting looking toilet. I don't even know if it's supposed to be in here, but it's in the box, so we're going to include it. And it looks like you have a bunch of belts. Let's put the crutches with the wheelchair. And you got these belts. And 
another folding chair. Heather! Hi, Heather. Oh, more belts. There's a gray folding chair. This looks like it goes to that table. Another black folding chair. We've got some more belts here. Another belt looks like a robe tie. Some more belts. Silver folding chair. Looks like some more table parts and other parts to put together. Tons of belts in here. I if this is supposed to be WCW. Is that a different WCW? I don't know. That's what this sign says. I don't know. That, that's there. And uh, here's another belt and another ladder here. Another ladder. I don't know. There's a third crutch I'll include it. I don't see a fourth one, but we'll, I'll put it in. And there's another belt. Here's another belt there. And then it looks like you've got a bunch of clothes. That I'm not even sure they definitely go with this, but they're, they're in the box. That's the Undertaker. The Undertaker, Rob saying a bunch of clothes and stuff for that. I don't know. And uh, this is another piece for. And this is a like a metal, and another piece. There's a lot of those pieces. They just have to be. Put together. Here's another piece of clothes. This is another WCW. I'm not sure that's the same thing, but it's a garbage can. Garbage can. Something about a garbage can here. I don't know. And this says WF, not sure what it is, but we'll put it in there. And that couple of pieces you'll have to do by uh, Google Lens for sure. And this looks like two grave things. One says The Undertaker on it. All right, there you have it, guys. It looks like a diorama. Hi, Mary, honey. How are you? <laughs> welcome in, welcome in, welcome in.
Linda's in for 35. Thank you guys. Yes, older company. <coughs> 37 to Gaylene. Hi, Sharon, honey. Sharon, did you change your name? You guys are killing me with these name changes. <laughs> 42 to Gaylene now. All right. No place like home is out. Not recently. Okay. All right. Yeah, this it probably is um, for sure, Heather. Um, WF and whatever that WCW is. Yeah, this is this. I think says Sharon. All right, Linda came in for 44. Gaylene's in for 46. Thank you, ladies. 50 now to Linda. Hi, Mama Beth. Gaylene is out. Sharon is out. Oh, I'm sure Heather. All right, we're going to count it down to Linda. Hi, Roy. Yes, Roy, wrestling stuff. How are you, hon? All right, we're going to go once. We're going to go twice. Yeah, as long as you guys give me permission, I don't mind. Awesome, Roy. Fair warning. And we're going to be sold to Linda for $50. Thank you, Linda. Can you ship with Saturday stuff? A hundred percent, Linda, of course. You know I will. Yeah, the belts alone, right? I agree. Those belts, just all of those belts. out there you can put this with all right thank you thank you thank you guys appreciate it a little dusty a little dusty linda but guess what that's free we give that for free here at the auction <laughs> Was that a toilet? Yes, Shaney, it was a toilet. We sell everything here at the auction. Kitchen sinks, toilets, and all. You never know what we bring. It's all good. 
Yum, says Linda. Yum, yum. <laughs> Defense of, whoops, did I lose my camera? I did, didn't I? I did, didn't I? This one is called Defense of Soul. New in package. Foreign Soldiers Collection. This one is awesome. This one is called Honor Guard. I'm sorry about the glare, guys. I tried to not do the glare. $20 start, all three. All right, as little of a glare as possible, guys. All right, baby. Lindsay's one is over here. The other one's back. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh, see you later. See you later. What, honey? Can you see if Todd's here? He just texted me about the airplane. He asked me if we listed any of the airplanes we got. He was interested. All right. Vintage Memories is in for 30. Margot, Sharon, let me know. I really wanted salmon tonight, Robbie. All right. Maybe tomorrow, Vintage Memories. It's very hard to get. Unfarmed, if that's the way you want to say it. Um, non farmed, Atlantic, wild. Most of the wild is actually, it's not even Atlantic, it's what is most of the wild salmon come that we find when we can find wild salmon? Alaska. Alaska? Yeah, it's very hard even to find that. Flippin' Hot Fine says she just made tuna stick. I'm going to make pork eat soup. Robbie's going home to make pork chops. Yes, Alaska, Norway. Yes. All right, honey. All right, Sharon is out. Robin, let us know. Margo's in for 35. 37 would be the next bid. Thirty-eight to vintage memories. Cheney comes in for 40. Getting steak delivered because some of us can't cook. Osma. It's not that hard to cook a steak. You got a grill or a broiler. Margo's out. Vintage Memories is in for 44. Cheney is out. We're going to call it to Robin going once. Yep, pork chops and applesauce. Not that I can eat the applesauce. I'll just have the pork chops. <laughs> yes, but I always mess it up. Listen, the only way you mess steak up is if you overcook it. Giving it a fair warning. And we're going to be sold to Vintage Memories for $44. Thank you, Robin. All right. 
So just little old me now. Robbie had to exit. Exit exit stage right. Linda Long, that sounds so delish. What's Linda having? Orange baked salmon, double yum. Mm. All right, I have some of this costume jewelry. See if there's any interest in it. We'll do it on a countdown as soon as I show it all. I would want to say that's wood, but it's not. It's like hollow. So I'm not sure. Let me put my camera up a little bit better. I get stuffed salmon. Stuffed with what? KK. I have to be careful because I'm allergic to shellfish, so I can't like, get crab stuffing or anything like that. I know it's good, but pica shells, Hawaii. Ah, awesome, Barbara. All right. Okay, well, then maybe that's going to go with the puka shells. <laughs> they're not puka shells. They're, but, they're, but they're like for the summer, right? Here's another one. Yeah, shrimp. I can't eat shrimp, unfortunately. And another one. So these are going to be all necklaces, guys. This is Bonchick, New York. I have no idea. Those are wood. I think you got two sets in here of those. This is all vintage, too, guys. This, um, a lot of this came from the storage unit. Actually, there's three of those in here. Here's another pair of these. These look like those. You guys remember those candies we used to eat off the necklace? That's what that one looks like. This one says made in India. Unfortunately, it got unhooked, but it's not broken. You're just going to have to rehook it. It's longer. You can double it up. On the bottom rack. Oh, do they still make them? Oh, this one looks like one of those, too, in a way. <laughs> a lot of nice summer necklaces in here. This one says this one glows in the dark. Like, I love steak tartare. You do, Ozma? Yeah, me too, Ozma. I'm so, I'm so bad. People get so upset with me sometimes. Like, um, um, I'm like, Gail was here and I think Robbie, like, couldn't even cook her burger enough and Robbie was just cringing <laughs> because it's like crazy. All your protein needs in two minutes. <laughs> now this one says this one glows in the dark too, so you might as well have two of them, huh? 
Well done and shoe leather for me. Ugh, Heidi. Heidi, you know what? You and you and Gail have a lot in common. You guys should really get together. She's over in New Hampshire half the time. You guys should definitely get together. You guys can get your steak well done. Talk about our wonderful, never mind, I won't go there. All right, a couple more pieces and then we'll call it. Then we'll count it down, guys. <laughs> uh, maybe, Heidi. <laughs> maybe you guys are on the same page, just saying. <laughs> I may have come up while she was here. All right, there you go. There you have it, guys. I don't know what's in here. We're going to throw that one in also. Actually, wait, I have another one here. I didn't realize it. Hold on. But wait, there's more. All right, we're going to count it down. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to be sold. Wow, Barbara Phillips, nice deal. Five dollars for all of that. Jeez Louise. Holy cow. Nice, nice, nice. Everybody was sleeping. You guys were sleeping on that. Barbara's picked herself up some really nice deals in the last week. Barbara's going to be making money. That's all right, Barbara. You come back and you spend it. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right it is very important it is very important i have a friend i have a friend he's a cat in a hat he's uh got his cat in the hat tag here i don't know if there's a year on it i didn't check No, but it does say do not place in the infant crib or bassinet. But I don't see a year on it. It takes a little bit um, shredded. I won't say totally shredded, but starting to, starting to show a little signs of shredding anyway. All right. He's a he's as big as T. <laughs> well, let's not get silly now. Let's not get silly. But I will give you a measurement if you guys absolutely want one. Let me see. I don't even know if I have my measuring tape here. I don't. I don't. I don't. So he's this big. He's this big. I'm checking out his butt. Oh, you want to check out his butt? All right. So his butt says official movie cat merchandise. That's what his butt says. Anybody want him? Anybody want him? Want to count it down? Let me take a picture. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen. Hi, Melanie. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine. 
time, Mike. Seven, six, da-da! Five, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to be sold. Donna, come in and say hi. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, Melanie's going to get them. Thank you, Melanie. Oh, wait, I've got to write the necklaces down. Oh, that's not going to be hard for me to remember. Barbara Phillips with the steel. All right, and Melanie with the cats in the hutch. Thank you, Mel. Just got home and I'm eating. Oh, she's going to sleep after that. I know what that means. <laughs> Nap time. Nap time. All right. All right, guys. Um, let's see. You guys want hair equipment or glasses? How about a purse? Let's do a purse. Let's see. I don't know what kind of purse this is. This just looks like a vintage purse. This is just a vintage purse. It's cute, though. Do you guys want a couple of purses, or should we just do one? This is different. This is made in Indo handmade in Indonesia. Huh. This is very interesting. Handmade in Indonesia. What do you guys think? Made with maybe bamboo or something? Very clean. It's got like this fabric on the inside. I so need a nap. I knew you were going to need a nap. I knew you were going to need a nap. What do you think? Anybody interested? Made in Indonesia? Should we can do them both? Oh, KJ, I'm sorry. I forgot you were here, KJ. Should we do them both? This one's different, too. This one's vintage. This is just a vintage purse. We'll do them both. All right, let's see. It's got one of these. T, t needs a little. Oh, there we go. T needed to figure it out a little bit. <laughs> that a little damage there? Let me see. I can't tell. Yeah, there is a little bit damage there, guys. Just fire beware. Fire beware. There is a little bit of a, almost like a little tear there. Yeah, they're both vintage. KJ's like, Donna, make her stop. <laughs> this one's really clean, though, considering. Well, they both really are. They both really are a nice condition. Gaylene, what does that mean? You want me to count them down? 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. KJ, they might make a nice gift for your wife or your daughter. <laughs> 7 or daughter-in-law. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold.
Margo's going to get him for 18. Thank you, Margo. All right. All right, let me switch my camera back. All right. Well, hopefully you guys know what game this is for. This is a, a game controller. It says Extreme 3D Pro. It's a Logitech. X3D Logitech Extreme 3D Pro. Anybody have a clue? Hold the joystick. Well, I know that, Robin. I just don't know what game it's for. <laughs> All right. Let's throw in some of these. This box is sealed. So I don't, oh, no, it's not. No, but they CD... I don't know if they use these anymore, but you probably could sell these out of country. Uh, Maxwell MF2HD floppies, and they are still in their package in there. Here's another one, 10 high density, three and a half disc. It's IBM formatted. And... Here is Sony, and it, they're all in a case, and they're all in there. I don't know. you got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40 of them there. 40 plus another maybe 5 and 10, 15, so like 55, 55 of them. And not in the box, but I'll put throw the box in here since I have it here with all the books. Boxes sell sometimes too. This is for Motorola Droid from Verizon. In case you want to part that stuff out. This is um, Sonic Scrubber, interchangeable brush head, sealed in the box, medium firm. I guess it's for the Sonic toothbrush, maybe, or cleaner. Not sure. We'll put that in there. And I'm not sure what this wire is for. It says USFPC Elect a Light Assembly. It's got one of those... Um, on and off things, but it's got a funky end here. But we'll throw it all in, make it like an electronics lot, I guess. See what else I have in electronics. Looks like some pieces to an otter box.
No interest, guys. We'll pass on it if you guys have no interest. It's fine. I'll make Rob list them. It's all good. Gaylene says, waiting on starting bid. Let's just bid on it, Gaylene. What do you want to pay me for it? Come on, Gaylene. All right, Gaylene says 15. All right, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one and we're going to be sold all right gaylene for 19. gaylene sneaks in all right gaylene thank you honey Thank you, KJ, for your bits. All right. I know, me too, KK. Don't write it, KK. We'll find something else to put with it next time. All right. Yesterday we had a couple of micro machines. I think I found the last of whatever we have. Um, one of them... Is this... Um, aircraft carrier kind of boat thing it's been opened guys it's been open we're gonna call it used and then this is um trains this one the cards are separated from the train there and then there's another one that it looks like there's a whole set of trains missing from the card. So the top one has the trains, if you can see it. And the bottom is missing. And I'm not sure if these tracks are made for this, but these tracks were in here. So I'm going to include all these tracks. Looks like maybe the train fits on those tracks, but I don't know for 100% sure. We're going to throw them in. And then yesterday, I don't know if you saw, I was trying to match up one of the cards to one of the uh, micro machines, and I couldn't find the cards. So I have three loose cards. I don't know if there's a market for the loose cards, but there's three of them there as well. And we'll sell that all together. So you got the Micro Machine uh, Train High Speed Bullet. Then you have the Power Sound Train. And then you have the Railroad Tracks. And you have the Aircraft Carrier, which is this one here, Aircraft Carrier. $20 start, guys. You want to start this? Somebody want to start?
Thank you, John. All right, John comes in for 20. Twenty two to KJ. Thirty to John. Mike, pay attention. <laughs> so the top one, yes, the trains are in here. The card is just separated. So all the trains are in the top, top one. All right. Oh, maybe that's why it's separated, because it says something about the tracks. It says includes 10 tracks. Well, guess what? The tracks are here. They're just not in there. So the one on the bottom, you've got the top row of trains. And then it looks like maybe the tracks were on the bottom of this too. I'm not sure, but you get in the tracks anyway, and you're getting that aircraft carrier. That one is used in the box, um, but you're getting all these tracks. Thirty-five to John, forty to Ed. Forty-five to John. All right, and let us know. John's in at 45. We're going to start counting it down. It comes in for 50. John's going to be out. We're going to count it down to Ed. Going once. And going twice. Make your comment two minutes after live ends, you can. What does that mean, KK? Fair warning.
And we're going to sell it to Edgefrida for $50. Thank you, Ed. Hi, Clearwater. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I didn't understand why I thought somebody was, I don't know. I don't know why I thought that meant. All right, I got three more GI Joes here, guys. One is the M O P P Marine. The other one is the 40 millimeter grenade machine gunner, and the other one is false Sherm Jaeger officer Monte Casino World War II. The box on this is one of these that opens like this. All right, we have 35 now from No Place Like Home Crochet. All right, again is the Desert Storm 10th Anniversary 2001 MOPP Marine. The 40 millimeter grenade machine gunner. Let's see if I can give you a year on this one. It's 2000. And the full Shem Jaeger officer. And that one is Monte Casino, and he is 2000 as well. So you're going to get all three. All right, we have Vintage Memories in for 44. KJ, let us know. 46 would be the next bid. Or No Place Like Home Crochet. Forty six to no place like home crochet. Vintage memories is going to be out. Fifty to Shaney. KJ is out. We're going to count it down to Shaney. No place like. Home crochet is out. Going once. Twenty-five. 
going twice. And we're going to give it a fair warning. And we're going to be sold to Shaney for $50. Thank you, Shaney. At least these aren't naked, right, Shaney? <laughs> oh, poor Shaney with her naked G.I. Joes. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. No, they are not. You know, with all your talking in here, you could have been in here talking to everybody. Instead of making excuses that you can't come in. All right, let's do some of these. I told you I found some more of these um, rosaries and religious articles. This one is made of wood. <laughs> oh, stop it. You're ridiculous. These are all bracelets. They're still actually wrapped in the package. We'll leave them. This is um, hematite, this one. Stretch bracelet hematite. These in here are wooden in there. Here's a heart one with wood. Maybe, Barbara, you probably know better than anybody, hon. What does KK say in CD? They're not CDs. KK? They're rosaries and religious articles. Well, let me show the rest of them first before we count them down. Music. All right, guys, there you go. I'm going to get all of that.
KK says she wants to do it as a countdown, guys. Should we do it as a countdown as soon as I see a bid? Heather will help KK if you want to go eat, sweetheart. Thank you, Heather. All right, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. Looks like Mama Beth. Ooh, Melanie. All right. Thank you, guys. All right, guys, these will be a nice, easy list. Three die cast vans, uh, all new Chevy, full size vans made um, by the most dependable, long lasting truck. 1996 on these. New inbox, you're going to get one, two, and three. All the same. So three of them, guys. One, two, and three. Hey, MP. All right, John's going to give us 30 for them. Thank you, John. Thirty four to vintage memories. It's KJ O Ranch. I was just asking about you. I said I haven't seen you in a couple of days. How are you, Karen?
All right, John's going to be out. Just working. Oh, I know. Oh, I think she was kidding, Barbara, because I was the, <laughs> the way I was shaking the camera. Exactly. <laughs> All right, Karen's going to be out. We're going to count it down to vintage memories going once. And we're going to go twice now. And we're going to give it a fair warning. And we're going to sell them to Vintage Memories for $44. Thank you, Robin. Oh, awesome. Nice pickup. Yay. Don't tell Rob. He'll be like, T, she'll let me list those. I always sell things behind his back. <laughs> I got a lot of that expensive die cast coming. Stuff that I probably will have to list. But if you guys jump on it and... Give me a fair dollar for it. You know, maybe I won't have to. Maybe I could bring it to auction. I just, I can't sell them for a dollar, you know. Um, they're going to be vintage, carded, um, signed and numbered, red lines and stuff like that. Um, plus a lot of corgi and a lot of, um, oh gosh, I can't think of the name of the other ones. But, you know, cars that sell, you know, for quite a few bucks. But we'll see. We'll see. If you guys are interested, then we'll bring them. If not, I'll have to list them just to make my money back. All right, guys. This is a beautiful set. It is costume that I know of. I don't think it's anything. All right, clear water. All right, well... I'm going to get some of it when I get back to New York this week, so we'll see. Some of it, not all of it, because I won't be able to fit it all. It's a tremendous, it's a tremendous buy. The stone in the top is blue. I mean, all the stones are blue, but they it's really, really nice set. Nice piece of bling. Yes, flipping hot finds. Yes, very nice piece of bling. All right, you want to count it down, Bob? We'll count it down. We'll go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. Barbara's going to pick it up for 15. Thank you, Bob.
Yeah, that's a nice set. That's definitely a nice set. All right. I have these blingy turtles. I'm going to bring them as a, as a lot. See if you guys want to resell them. I say they're blingy turtles, but I don't know. Maybe they're blingy skulls again. What do you guys think? You tell me. Do you think they're skulls again? Yeah, I guess they're skulls. I, I thought maybe they were um, turtles, but there are uh, definitely skulls now that I look at them. All right. Let's Put them out. Oh, I'll fix my camera in just a minute. Right? It, I almost thought they were turtles too, but I know that the more I look at them, no, I think they're, I think they're skulls. Maybe you can get away with both of them. I don't know, but no, I think they're skulls now. Now, now the skull is showing. I think there's about 10 of them. Maybe eight. Number eight is got a ring caught around it, something or other here. All right, I'll fix it when we go up. All right, so there's eight of them, guys. Head down, feet out of the side. I know, but look, it, look, Asma. It's <laughs> I don't know. All right, you figure it out. You, I, I, I say skull and crossbones. You could say turtle. Whatever you, whatever you want them to be, that's what they are. <laughs> whatever you want them to be, that's what they are. <laughs> Either way, we're going to sell them. Yes, they're charms, Karen. Yes. <laughs> And look, I have more. But wait, there's five more. But the five more are just plain. They're um they're not um oh they're different sizes too. Oh, so you got one, two, they don't have bling on them, three, four. And five. All right, we'll include those as well. Is the dress blue or gold? She picker. I did a whole thing on Meet Robin T about the dress <laughs> when we would do it when we did our YouTube channel and all that was going on. It's out there if you find you could find it. I'm sure. All right, KJ comes in for five. Karen comes in for ten. Let's count it down. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And we're going to be sold. And the skulls are going to go to... KJ for 12. 
Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So last night we had um, tragedy and comedy with those pins. Tonight we have the masquerade party. And the, mask, the masks do not have the, um, unfortunately, do not have the back. So you will have to invest in the backs. But these are cool. Probably make a nice theater lapel pin if you're going to the theater or if you have somebody who's acting in a play and you want to give a gift or where to support them. That's what, 24? Is that right? 24 of them? Four and six? Five and six? And you guys want to just go ahead and place a bid. We'll count it down after I lay them all out. And we're going to be one shy. We're really not one shy, but one of them was broken. So you are going to be one shy. So it's going to be 41. You're going to get 41 of them. And we're going to count them down. And we're going to go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to be sold. And the 41 masks are going to go to. Looks like Mama Beth for 20. Thank you, Mama Beth. All right, that was awesome. You should do well on those, Mama Beth. if you guys want to do a little hair 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 equipment have some hair equipment 
All right, first one's up, made in probably Korea, but let's double check. Yes, made in Korea on these hair, like they're like buns. So you've got like a gold, a copper, and a silver in this bag. You can see it. So it's like a silver, a copper, and a gold tone on those. We got some squinchy. That's what a, ha a hair trimmer, huh? Portion extremely sharp blades. All right. Probably should push the camera up and push these towards the back a little bit, huh? All right, I'm just grabbing a bunch of stuff out of the box. Bear with me for a second, guys, and then I'll bring them up on the screen. Promise, promise, promise. All right. Oops, oopsie. No Susan, right? Because we might have some bows. Just saying. You never know. All right. Scunchy. These are clips. Scunchy. More clips. Elastic. These are Con Air. Scrunchy. Large poly bands. Here's a bow. And then we have a bunch of these. Some of these guys are made in Hong Kong. Some of them are made in Taiwan. Some of them are just, that's Korea. I think this one is Taiwan. I don't remember now. Hi, Melody. How are you, sweetheart? Oh, this one's actually made in France. But they are all vintage for the most part. I mean, there might be one or two in here, China. This one's interesting with the calla lily on it. This one's got like bling seashells actually on that one. This looks like it came off one of the cards. Um, I'll tell you what that says. Uh, maybe I won't. It's X something. Zen Zin. Z H E N X I N. That says made in the good old USA. Here's two of these um, kind of clips matching. Here's a set of bows made in Hong Kong. And then a bunch of banana clips, pink and yellow.
denim with red and blue. It's just a plain black one of those clips. Here's some soft pastel colors. Oh, here's another one of these shell ones. Did I lose the uh, camera a little bit? Sorry. No, they're not all there's Barb. They're just not. And if there are, I'm sorry, but I'm not sitting and putting them together. <laughs> just not. <laughs> Here's a couple of more banana clips, a couple of more scrunchy. Another scrunchy. That's made in Hong Kong. I recognize that one. All right, here's the first pair, Barb. You happy there? <laughs> That's about it, though. I don't see any others. Sorry. What not just announced buyer appreciation giveaways. Woohoo, no more scammers looking for freebies. What does that mean? What what does buyer appreciation mean? You can do it just for the for the people that are buying. Here's another one of these in blue. This one looks like it might be a little off i don't know but we'll throw it in anyway check some of these for bake light too guys you never know oh here's a pair some of these bands might be a little stretched out because of age guys i'm sorry yeah, this might be a match in here. I think I saw this one before. Oh, wow. Look at these. Aren't those hot roller holders? As a seller, yes. It's just for buyers in the chat. Oh, awesome. Oh, that's good news. Good news. Here's some bows. Some more clip bananas. Banana, Fanna. Mm, is that one broken? Yeah, that one's broken. Leave that one out. All right, a few more guys, and then we'll call it. Oh, that might be a set in the bag there. Well, this is a match to the one that's there already. Banana, banana, bobana, right? All right. How about those little heart clips? And let's throw in these two. 
They are two bags made in Korea. They're like hair bow. Um, ponytail holders. Two bags of those. Made in Korea. What do you guys think? Done and done. Here's another scrunchie clips. You know, and a couple of big holders for your hair. Like, and I actually found, I think we sold a bunch of these, but I found two more Winnie the Pooh hair holders. Oh, and two more scrunchies. The acrylic clip and the poly bands. Oh, and some more clips. All right. That's it. That's it. Maybe. <laughs> All right, you're done and done? Done and done. And these are not hair clips, but they're feather earrings. But let's just throw them in there. I don't know. I don't know why they're there, but we'll throw them in there. Feather earrings. Karen's in for 35. Forbidden by Mama Ozma. Oh, yes, Mama Ozma didn't like the feather earrings. Saw the feathers in the hair. <laughs> what I saw. Oh, wait, I found two match. Oh, no, they're not matches. Never mind. Um. I thought I saw another feather thing here. Oh, yeah, I did. Um, but what is it? Oh, it's like a feather kind of clip or barrette, I guess. It's called Princess Accessories, and it's like a feather clip. All right, we'll get Mama Ozma really charged up. <laughs> Sorry, Mama Ozma. Oh, here, I knew I saw one. I knew it's like a feather comb. It's got like a little comb and it's got this long feather thing in there. All right. I promise that'll be it now. That'll be it after that last banana clip and that last clip and that one and that one. All right. We're good. Up oh, another bow. Peter! <laughs> Because Ozma is a very loyal member of the channel, Peter. Peter, you can, you too can have a wrench and a hammer. We don't discriminate here. You can have a hammer too. You just have to subscribe and become a member. All right, she pickers in for thirty-seven. Or what Ozma said, because she's awesome. That too. Actually, you know what, guys? I'm going to throw two headbands in here, too. Uh, new hairbands. Two packages of those as well. Why not? Why not? All right. We're going crazy here at the end of the night. especially since I dropped all my pens. All right, we got She Picker in at 37. She, say, she said I'd be a 10-year-old pothead. Well, now what does that mean? You're a 40-year-old pothead? <laughs> uh, that's my love you. You know that. 
<laughs> she pickers in for 42 now. Thank you, ladies. Actually, I found these two plastic clips, guys. They do need a little cleaning, but they're two pastels, a yellow and a green. Oh, and one of these. I think the hairdressers use these, but I don't know. I guess if you're doing your own hair, you might want those. I don't know. I might have to consider it. Yes, thumbs up, guys. Please, please, please. Especially because I have no idea all night. My my count has not been working at all. I don't think we had a lot of people in here tonight, but um, I definitely have no idea the count. It's been like zero or one all night on my... Um, All right, Karen's going to be out. We're going to count it down to sheep picker going once. Oh, thanks, Gaylene. Going twice. And we're going to give it a fair warning. Did Donna fall asleep? I haven't seen a comment from her in a while. And Lori, we're going to be sold to you. Thank you, thank you. For $42. Oh, shit. Oh, that's right. She did say that, didn't she? <laughs> You're so bad, Asma. Ozma, Ozma, Ozma. All right. So, guys, um, last night I sold, what, like 12, 12 of these glasses for uh, $30. Um, and I counted them all out to everybody. So, with that, I still have a lot more to do 12. So you get 12 pairs. They're generic. They're 400 uh, UV. Uh, they're vintage, though. I will tell you that. I saw a couple, I think, that said something. Oh, I think these said made in um, Taiwan. Oh, they match my shirt. What do you think, guys? <laughs> I'm no Donna. <laughs> um, so if anybody wants... Uh, 12 pairs of these. Don't be laughing at me, sheep picker. Um, $30 is the price. $30, and it's just an assortment. Uh, these are Taiwan. I have too big a face for those. Dude, that is awesome. <laughs> you want another set, Margo? All right, you got it, sweetheart. <laughs> Oh, she's laughing. Uh, oh, Firefighter663 likes my video. I'm on TikTok now. It's the auctionator. She'll be back, right? <laughs> All right, calling it down. One more time, guys. One more time. You never know what you get in the in here. All sunglasses. Like I said, some of them are real vintage. Some of them do say Hong Kong. They do have to be clean, some of them, though. They are filthy. Ones I don't sell, I guess I'll have to clean Taiwan again. How you doing, Happy Maker? All right. And uh, that's going to do it for me, guys. 
I, uh, I'm going to call it. I still have those uh, pogs hanging out over there if anybody's interested. Maybe if nobody buys them by the end of the week, we'll have to bring them to auction again. Um, one last batch of them. Here's another hair clip I'll include in there, she picker. Can I see the bottom? No, you can't. I'm not selling it. <laughs> I have two of them, actually. There's one over here, too. Peter, maybe for the right price. I now have 1,100 listings, Mama Beth, yay. I don't know, Peter. I don't really know. I, I, I have to do some more research on them, but no, KK, I don't want to sell them right now. And, and KK, I, I got to do some research on them. I, I have to do some research on them because I think they're worth something. I do. So, yeah, they, um, they came with the banana boxes from the estate in Jersey. So, you know, I told Donna, we're going to check them out because I'm not going to be that fast to let them go. Okay. All right. I'll do that, Peter. Thank you. All right. All right, guys. Um, I'm surprised that's the first time you guys noticed that they've been. I've had one on the shelf there and one over there forever since. Since um, God knows. All right, I'll leave them out so I can take pictures of them. Um, tomorrow is what? Tuesday. I think I have a class at five. I think I'm pretty sure of a class at five, but I'll double check. Um, and I know Brian's on during the day tomorrow, so we'll see what happens. I don't know. Morning? Yeah. And Don will probably do what not tomorrow night. So we'll see. I don't know. I'm not making any promises for tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. Heather, so the pogs, this is the deal I've been selling on the pogs, and this is the last bag that I have. It's a thousand pogs. I'll get it. And actually, this is, you know, this is actually getting a bonus compared to everybody who bought the other deals. It's a thousand pogs plus whatever I had left in slammers. Everybody else got 20. I think these have a few more than 20 in them. Um, some are new in package. And uh, some are metal. Some are the big, thick ones. There's also a pod case in here. Um so some of them are like this and some of them are the thicker ones they're floating around in here i dumped them all in here uh most of the pods are made in taiwan they are um vintage older ones and we were getting 65 dollars for the thousand pods and the 20 plus slammers yes come join oh that's right kk goes on tuesday nights too for bingo so guys if i don't come on go over and see kk over at bingo i always forget she does that on tuesday nights um you want them heather okay they're yours honey um yes i think she's planning on going i don't know if she put a stream up yet either 8 11 or 9 11. she didn't say either way when she came in so um Guys, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to come back and leave a comment. I haven't done a giveaway in a while. Maybe I will. Um, I think I owe you guys a giveaway anyway. Somebody remind me, definitely on Wednesday, because I will come on on Wednesday if I don't come on tomorrow. Um, add them to my airplane ticket I bought the other day. Airplane ticket. <laughs> airplane ticket? You bought an airplane ticket? Heather, what do you mean you bought an airplane ticket? <laughs> Is he coming to visit me? 
Oh, nine. Okay. No, 1911. Robin. <laughs> oh, the models. Yes, the model airplane. Yes, that's right. Yes, okay. The uh, no Northwest, right? Yes. So maybe later on time. Yes. Oh, she put a seven. Oh, 7 Eleven Central. Okay, because I know she has one up for Thursday. She may not have put one up yet for tonight. Okay, so 811. So go over and see her at 811. And guys, don't forget um, if if you don't um, follow him already, Brian always comes on Tuesdays before us at 1 p.m. Eastern. So go over and see Brian too as well. Um, and you never know. I may pop over and see him one of these days. We're living so close together, I feel like we should see each other more. But I know he's going back up to the warehouse this weekend to um, bring a lot of stuff down. In fact, I don't know. Maybe he's not even going on this week. I'll have to check with him. If he doesn't, then maybe I'll come on daytime. We'll see. I'll have to talk to him. All right, guys. Love you all. Appreciate your purchases. Thank you so much. And uh, for those of you who I haven't invoiced yet, I'll invoice you in the morning. If you haven't paid your invoice yet, please pay that in a timely manner. I appreciate it. And uh, hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. If not, I'll see you on Wednesday. Have a great night, guys.